Welcome back to Baseline Farms. So we are working in the big garden today and we think we're going to be able to get this all done today. Right babe? This, this part of it? Yes. This part of it. So we're just going to um, put the valve on the outside right here and then um, spray paint it black. That's pretty much it and then we can fill it up with dirt but we still need a little adapter that goes in this um, in this part of the, I don't know, PVC, what would you call that part of the thing? The, uh, the Netafim adapter, 17 millimeter to half inch threaded adapter, so you can hook up the Netafim. Okay. So. And then the reason why we're painting it black is because you're not supposed to use PVC above ground like this and so to protect it from the sun we're painting it what we should do is use like a metal or copper or something to come out of the ground um, but we're on a budget so this is affordable right now so yeah and then after we get this done then we can fill it up with soil and I can plant those plants because they're outgrowing their containers so John's gonna cut all the uh, PVC and then I'm gonna glue it and that's pretty much it. So we're just gonna go ahead and get started. far we have gotten in the garden today it's so exciting now we did run out of dirt so we have to get a couple more yards of dirt to fill in two flower beds in the back and we also need these little adapters right here let me show you see these little adapters we still need to get these adapters right there for all the flower beds so we can add the drip so that we can have drip irrigation in all the beds but let me just go ahead and give you a run through of what I planted so in this first um, in this first row right here, I have Lake Valley Organic cu Cucumber. And then on that second row right there is a Botanical Interest Pickling Cucumber. Over here in the second bed, I have some Zucchini Squash by Johnny Select Seeds. 
And then over there on the farthest bed, I have some uh, burpees, pickling cucumbers. Now all of these seeds, I should have just waited a little longer and just sowed them right into the garden beds. But I don't know, I got super excited and I was going off a list that said we could start planting these indoors where I would have probably just waited. And, but everything's doing really well. And I'm probably still gonna plant um, some other, I don't know, maybe some squash, something else in that bed. I just have so many garden beds to fill in. So whew, we still have a lot of work. We still have a bunch of tomatoes that I could pop in here. And I'm probably gonna do that tomorrow. But other than that, this is how far we've gotten. Um, yeah, so that's so exciting. Um, thank you for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed this video and I'm gonna be planting some more things so then maybe you could just join me on this journey of growing because this is my first time ever growing in this big garden and at this magnitude. Um, I started off in a tiny little garden that we built and now we're up to 4,000 square feet of gardening space. So that's super exciting. Um, other than that, take care, be safe, and thank you for watching. Bye-bye.